You okay? Yeah. It's uh, Thursday morning and uh, I'm on my way to Senegal to the Fatala Animal Reserve and right now I'm at the ferry uh, on my way to, to the other side of uh, Banjul and eventually crossing the border over to Senegal where this uh, animal reserve is. So right now it's on uh, a boat trip half for half an hour to the other side of the capital city. Finally, we are at the Fatala uh, Wildlife Park and hopefully we will see uh, rhinos and giraffes and buffalo today. So all the park is 6,000 hectares, but the moment we use only 2,000 and animals are totally free. So to the wildlife, you have the big five, they are elephant, rhino, lion, buffalo and leopard. We have only three of them here. So we have lions, five of them, two male, three female, all of them have name. We have Masai, Taini, Kalaila, Taiga and Sinanga, one of the big five. But it's not part of the safari. So they are in a camp where people work with them since they were small. It's a white rhino, it's a male. Where come from the word of white rhino? The Dutch people say vice, it's a male. The mouth is large, English cannot pronounce it, they say white. It's where come from the word of white rhino. But the real word is a squalid rhino, the black one, pooklet rhino. And uh, they both cannot breed white because the black one, females, they carry 15 months of pregnancy. The white one, females, they carry 16 months of pregnancy and they are in danger. There was a couple before the male killed the female with horns in the year 2012. He wanna make to have baby, the female don't want to, they fight, he fought it with horns. Now we have only this one left in the park. They live up to 40 years old. Why 40 years? Every 10 years they lose their molars. And females, they carry 16 months of pregnancy. They are in danger. The only reason why we still have, we don't have a female. The white one, they eat only grass. They call them grouses. The black one, they eat both leaf and grass, they call them browsers. So they have some places where they go to toilet, is how they mark their territory. So this one, they can live up to 40 years old. They look like human fingerprint, they are totally different. And we have a baby of four months old, that one is a female. Everybody okay? You have pictures and information? Okay, if you have any question, you are welcome. So we have in total eight of them here. They are the same family with Okapi, but some people say camel. Why? The scientific name of giraffe is Camelo giraffa pardalis. They don't drink every day, once or two times in a week. And there is nine types of giraffe. And why we breed them in the park? In the year 2006, there was only 170 left in the wild. So they are the biggest antelope in the world. And they have one thing special under the neck here, we call Tewle. That dewlet is like AC to the car. They clean this from skin to skin. So this buffalo, they are the smallest size of the buffalo in the world. They are the savannah forest buffalo. They live up to 25 years old. Females, they carry 12 months of pregnancy. That one is the alpha male, the big bull is that one. They call it bull. And there are some white hair on close to them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The savannah forest buffalo, they live up to 25 years old.
So guys, this one are the biggest antelope in the world. We call Elen antelope. It's the local name, the scientific name, Toro Tragos de Dianos. They live up to 25 years old. Females, they carry nine months of pregnancy. Other countries, they have this type of Elen, but more smaller. This one, they can weigh 900. They are the biggest in the world. And before the raining season, there was uh, 48 of them here in the breeding area, but they have new babies. But we don't allow mostly people get in <coughs> because there are some buffaloes and they are very dangerous animals. Yeah.